I would say if you had to use one word, I would say eager. There was not a lot of poking and prodding to get guys going. And to me, that's a good sign. They're focused, they're ready, they want to go play, they want to go practice, they want to build on what they've done. This team is eager and, and they're ready to, to, to get better. So I want conditioning the middle thing, which are the little things as we go through and apply what you learn here. Here we go, Sanat. Our operation was good. Our operation in the huddle is getting better. The times that we're no huddle, I think we're, 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 we're playing fast. And I think that our control of the line of scrimmage has gotten better. Now, it, just like I said in front of the team, it's connecting the dots. They're capable of scoring. They're capable of making good adjustments. And they're capable of, of uh, bringing energy and excitement. A message that we use with our offense was we're going to go further faster. So just because you've had success in an area doesn't mean you're going to continue to be successful. You have to continue to sharpen your craft and your tool. But at the same time, we're able to navigate some known roadblocks and the learning curve is faster because they should be able to retain and, and the growth has, has got to be there because your mistakes aren't the same anymore. So I think it's further faster. We're a pretty close group on offense. And then when you factor in, we have really talented dudes all over the place, receivers, crazy talented guys. And then O-line, we got a group that really hasn't played a whole lot, but they're, they're experienced at the same time and they're, and they're all coming together and, and kind of learning more about each other. And then our running backs room again, it's, they haven't played a whole lot, but they're super talented as well. You have got to have a hose to throw field smash against cover two. A much safer throw when you're throwing throw, uh, field flag is against what covers the Oh man. Man, that's when you alert it. Now you got a chance. Now you can put the ball up in the air, you can run to it. There's a lot of different throws you can make against man. With Coach Reader and Coach Gans, those are probably the two coaches who I deal with with the most and we kind of really know each other well and they know me as a person and I know them better. It kind of just, I don't know, it kind of just works right now. They can be as good as they want to be. I really believe that. I think you got a quarterback that is eager and, and hungry and uh, confident. I think you have an offensive line that is ready to show themselves. You have a lot of wide receivers that want to get the ball. You think about Harrison Bay Bowie and he's like steady Eddie. He's typically falling forward, not, you know, not a lot of negative plays. Just I think he's, he's ready to have some more explosive runs. I think that they can be a, an elite offense really if uh, they do what they need to do and we take care of the football and, and we're competitive and get better every day. We play some very good teams. So we have to have a very good team, and that means we just have to lock into focus on our purpose, our job, instead of worrying about offense, defense. That, that's a fan thing, that's an internet thing. That's why we come to ball games and, and watch games, because it's reality TV. <laughs> <laughs>